for induction? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Thank you so much. I'll head over right now. I told you it'd work out. Did you shave your vagina? Babe! That's it, Mama. Job right there. Oh, that hurts. That, that hurts. that hurts. That hurts. Push him out. Look down. Look down. <laughs> Let me see Gray Gray. You ready? That's your baby brother. He did get out of your belly. He did get out of my belly. That's right. He don't He's so. Want kisses. He, he don't want kisses. Yeah, he, I love you. Are you gonna take a picture of me and baby? Cheese. Cheese. Remember? Yeah, can come around. Okay, my love. Oh, you're tiny. <laughs> you're not gonna say it? What? Say it. What did I say? It clicked. <laughs> oh. Saying hi to the camera. Okay, come here. Yeah. Uh, so first time. Welcome. It's the first time we're filming as a family of four. Ta -da. All of us here. Ta-da. Ta-da. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Brielle. Oh, we're introducing you ourselves. Oh, he's doing. Grayson's it. doing it for us. And, and who are you? Grayson. Grayson. And this is. Baby brother. Baby brother, whose name will be revealed in a few minutes, but we got to do a little bit of a backstory. Can you say backstory? Backstory. Exactly. Tay and I first started dating in, what, April of 2017, and we moved pretty fast, especially for someone who's like, I don't want to be in a relationship. I'm going to be single. But when you know, you know. Grayson's out. That's that was right. all of two seconds. See you later, buddy. Gray. We started talking baby names pretty quickly into the relationship and we immediately agreed upon a boy name and a girl name. And those stuck until end of 2018 when we had Grayson. That was the name we talked about when we very there first started dating. There was never like a question. It was always going to be Grayson. We didn't have a second option. The second we found out it was a boy, we just were like, hi baby Grayson, hi Gray Gray. But when we found out we were pregnant with a boy this time, we were stumped. We were like, what are we going to name this kid? And the thing is too, is when you have your first kid, you're not naming them to make it sound good with their siblings. Like the first kid, yeah. it's a blank slate. When you say them, you want them to sound good together. Are we the only ones that think that way? I think a lot of people think that way. I don't know. Maybe we are. You're gonna. You, maybe you get a bunch of comments like, "What a weird way to name your kid." We'll, I, we'll find whatever. out. Whatever. 
But after our gender reveal, we ended up going to dinner together and we found this app. It was pretty much like Tinder for baby names. What was it called? Like Kinder? And you would swipe left or right if you liked a name. It was the first time I've swiped in a long time, so it's kind of Good to fun. know. Good to know. <laughs> We did get a few ideas from that app, but it was nothing that we immediately were like, that is it. And honestly, we didn't have a name for him until he was like a day or two old. So when we were using the app, there ended up being three names that we actually really, really liked and were contenders till the very end. There was one name he was set on that I wasn't set on, and one name that I was set on that he was not set on. So the very first name that we really liked and honestly called him by that name for the first couple of months after we found out that he was a boy and that name was Oliver. The reason why we did not end up going with Oliver was because it was one of the number one names last year. It was at least in the top five. And I personally don't want my kids to go to school and have to be like, I'm Oliver W, I'm this, I'm that. I wanted them to have unique names. Once we realized that it was such a popular name, we honestly, truly were thinking about just naming him Ollie. We liked Ollie better than Oliver, but we wanted him to have the option that if he were older, to go by Oliver to be more professional. But in the end, it just wasn't his name. Taylor still thinks that it should be his name. One of the other names that we really liked and was in our top four for the longest time was Parker. But with Parker, there isn't really a nickname. Park? Like, that's a little, that's a little silly if you ask me. And it was always kind of at the bottom of our top favorites list. It was always kind of a, like a backup name okay. if we decided against the other three. Okay, come back over this way, please. What is it? Let me see. It's a little snail shell. Cute, Gray. Nice find. Ew. Someone's gonna be riding out in a diaper. Yep. <laughs> then the name that I really, 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 really wanted, you've got ice cream in your beard, <laughs> really wanted to name him was Luca. If you guys watched the 15 names that I like but won't be using video, Luca was one of the ones that I named in that video. Well, about, uh-oh. You good, dude? I love how he just chokes and goes right back to it. I know. Doesn't phase it. Doesn't stop. Luca was one of the names I mentioned in that video. And then about, what, like a month later after I posted that video? The movie Luca came out. But then like after that, you said, okay, I think I can do Luca. I briefly thought that I could do Luca. We went all the rest of the pregnancy up until the point when we were in the car driving to the induction. He looks over at me and he goes, yeah, I don't think I can do Luca. After we've told friends and family it's probably gonna be Luca. After we were set, like his name was going to be Luca James Waldemar. Grayson, still to this day, will call him Luca James. So we're working okay. on it. Tay just couldn't get on board. It's still a name that I love and maybe in the future if we have another boy. So Luca was your favorite. Yep. Ollie was my favorite. Yep. And then... Parker was just a backup. And then we had one more. Yes, which is his name. Are gonna say it? So it's a very unique name. I've only heard of one person named this name and he's a toddler. Um, it's a girl I follow on Instagram. When I heard his name, I was like, that is such a cute and unique name. On Instagram and on TikTok, I had people guess his name and there was hundreds of guesses and so many, like literally one letter off, but nobody guessed it, not one yeah. person. His name is, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, why am I nervous? His name is... His name is Riser James Waldemar. So the reason that we chose the name Riser was because it was a uh, very unique name. Uh, we it's, like how it sounded with Grayson, Grayson and Riser. I think the biggest part for me was the definition. When we were driving to the hospital, I was looking up all the names. None of the names, Oliver is something about an olive tree. Like yeah. none of them had like nice meanings except for Riser. Do you wanna read it to them? Yeah, I'll read it. Uh, Riser, a leader, an overcomer, a person who rises to the challenge, a person who does not give up in times of adversity. Yeah, it's a strong name. Again, we were talking about nicknames for the baby's name and all that kind of stuff. Rye Guy. Rye Guy, yes. Rye, Rye Guy. 
That's his name is Riser James Waldemar. You can go. I can go? Yeah, you're Yes. You're dismissed. Bye guys. That is the end of today's video. If you guys liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. I post new videos every Saturday. Next week's video will actually be Grayson meeting Riser for the very first time. I put this video first because so many of you were asking what his name was and I didn't want to keep you waiting any longer. I hope you guys have a blessed week and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.